Good day, human audio science. This is Eladio Zubril, and welcome to a Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire Wi-Fi battle. Yeah, I know I haven't been doing Wi-Fi battles lately, but with Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire coming out, I want to get back into the metagame. So, I use a Politoed Ludicolo and Kingdra. Nothing that out of the ordinary, it's a rain team with Swift Slam. While my opponent Fawa just uses Latios, Scrafty, and White Curem. This is, of course, what happened. Now, we see Fawad there with his Mega Bracelet issuing a challenge. So I'm going to lead off with Politoed, and I'm gonna, just to bring out the rain. So Politoed is of course holding the Damp Rock, because I just want to have the rain up as long as I can. While he is right off the bat going to use that Latios site and e Mega Evolve his Latios. Now the thing is, he actually is going to be setting up the Calm Mind, which is actually going to be at my disadvantage. Now, if you really wanted to do that, you probably would have been better off going with the Soul Dew instead of the Mega Stone, but that's besides the point. So I'm just going to go for the Ice Beam. I'm not even going to do half because he is at plus one special defense, while his Psychic is going to do quite a bit of damage being at plus one. So I'm going to be able to go for another Ice Beam, which isn't quite going to get the KO, so he's just going to be able to take me down with the Shadow Ball. At that point, Palito is going to go down. So unfortunately, the rain is no longer something I can control that much. But on the other hand, it's only a 3-on-3 three -three battle, so it should go pretty quickly. So since I'm in the rain, Kingdra is going to outspeed Latios thanks to the Swift Swim with speed and special attack investments. So he's going to go into a Scrafty, which he can't really outspeed me. I'm going to just go for a Hydro Pump. In the rain, that is just going to do serious damage to that thing. That thing isn't even going to live the Hydro Pump. So he's going to go into his Curem Light, which... Okay, I'll be able to outspeed, but the thing is, I would need to one-shot it with the Dragon Pulse in order to just take it down, which honestly isn't going to happen. So he's going to be able to go for his own Dragon Pulse, and since I don't have any special defense investments in Kingdra, Kingdra's just going to go down. So, at that point, I, um, I see he has Life Orb, so it really doesn't make too big a difference because Ludicolo is going to outspeed, so I can just go for an Ice Beam of my own from Ludicolo, and then that's a dead cure him. And that is game. So, fairly simple match. I mean, I was using a, well, rain team, which, I mean, you could say it's broken because you get speed. But on the other hand, with the possibility of Mega Rayquaza and Prime Groudon coming out, that actually could be hit my disadvantage since they just completely negate the rain. In which case, I'd be able to use, I guess, a Primal Kyogre to counter them or something on the lines of Greninja to go for a protein move from using Mono Water. But that's besides the point. However, I am going to be doing tonight a free-for-all live stream with hopefully you guys will join and you guys can enter the battle since I've never done a live stream before, but I am looking forward to this. So that would be at 7 o'clock Eastern Time tonight. So I hope to see you guys there and I hope it'll be fun. Because, well... The Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire metagame has started, and I am just so excited to get involved with this. So, thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.